Welcome back to the restaurant show. We've got a treat for you today because if you're a fan of blueberry pancakes, this one I have a feeling is going to be outstanding. This is the blueberry lemon pancake combo and we are joined by Steve Dascom, owner of The Egg and I. And I am so glad to see you. Thank you for having us again. Well, the food is outstanding at The Egg and I. If you haven't been there off the belt line and it is just the best. But we're talking today about a blueberry lemon pancake mm -hmm. that I have a feeling is going to be just incredible. So talk talk us through this one. All right, well, first we got it starts out with our plain pancake, mm -hmm. which for us is a whole wheat pancake. So, and I like that about your pancakes because I'm always nervous to eat too many pancakes, but I feel good about a whole wheat pancake. <laughs> <laughs> Makes me feel better, grains. It does, and you know, if you try it, it I think it actually tastes better. I agree with you. Mm -hmm. so. Okay, and once you make your pancake, now the ingredients are probably pretty simple, right? Basic blueberries. Blueberries. Um, we toss them in an agave syrup. Okay. So. I didn't know that. Agave. What is agave? What is blue agave syrup? Uh, it's a cactus, but it's it's the syrup. It's like a simple syrup. Oh, okay. It's just I see. Uh, a little different. Yeah. Okay. I like it. Beautiful. And uh, this is a lemon curd that we make. Right. And it's it's not too tough. You know, basically. Okay. Uh, and well. you make this in-house, this lemon curd? Yes and no. Okay. Uh, that's one of the few times you, that we do open something, and, okay. but we still add it to something else to make it. Gotcha. Uh, this is a lemon pie filling. Oh, just, all it's right. Not, uh, we couldn't make lemon pie filling. It's right, right. You guys make just factor. about everything from scratch But then scratch we fold in, in uh, whipping cream, which is the acid in the lemon, mm -hmm. curds, uh, curds, uh, curdles curds the, the cream, uh -huh. and we end up with... Lemon you didn't curd. know you were going to give me a lesson in lemon <laughs> cream today, did you? Okay, so we did that, and we've done that beforehand just to save a little bit of time. Um, while we're talking about breakfast, so this is one that is new for spring, right? Or yes. on your spring menu. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yep, that's the new menu. I... Right here. Yeah. I was cheating. There we go. <laughs> yeah, we have several you know, items that. Yeah. So now we did something similar to this. About a year ago. Yeah, so you and have... I think I did it on TV, but I'm not sure. Well, I'm pretty sure that you did, because I remember some of those delicious breakfast items. Mm -hmm. uh, I want to say that you did like a waffle that had some fruit involved, but Probably. it was pretty good. I usually eat some leftovers before I come in later and eat, eat again. Um, so we do that. We're doing the lemon blueberry pancake. Okay. We also have, this was one of my favorites that we did a while back. This is on the spring menu, mm -hmm. the healthy turkey and veggie omelet. Which is delicious. It's Don't really, let really the fact good. that it's healthy. Yeah, they should even just take that out of the name because <laughs> it's a deterrent. The food if, is amazing. You, it's made with egg whites. And you know, if you don't want the egg whites, we can make it with regular eggs. Then yes. we won't call it healthy. <laughs> Okay, yeah, I think it's still healthy. Spectacular. I gotta try okay. to do this. Oh, this is a presentation here. Let's well, see if you, are you going all for the flip? Is that, whoa, that was great. You did yeah, well. I can smell it. This, it drills a little too hot, so it's a little dark. Yeah, you're on location. It's tough. <laughs> but that was really impressive. Well, the top nice. wasn't, <laughs> was, I knew it was going to be like that. But Pretty good. Hey, we'll take it. In. I could not do that flip in that manner. Um, so, um, another one on the spring menu, just to keep you in the loop, is the farmer's hash. So, that looks outstanding as well. Oh, yeah. um, That's very popular. So, um, there's lots of good items on the spring the last, menu. For the last, I don't know, since last fall, our hashes have been really very popular. Yes. And this is a medley of all kinds of different delicious mm -hmm. um, breakfast items. So, I want to talk a little bit about Easter. Can you believe it's almost here? I know. It's it goes what, fast. Not, not even two weeks. I know. So, uh, is the egg and I going to be open? Can folks come see you? Absolutely. Okay. Um, we only close Thanksgiving and Christmas. Oh, okay. You guys are so. open quite a bit. Goodness. Yes, we are. So, so all open the major for Easter. holidays and everything. Well, well, it's a good breakfast brunch holiday. You guys, not that you only have breakfast and brunch, but I feel like it's a good time to go out to eat with your family mm -hmm. and not have the mess at home. Have some good home style cooking uh, without the mess. So, and it's a very family friendly place you guys have. Um, yeah, the only thing is right now we're a little short-handed. Actually, we're quite short-handed. Let's, yeah, talk about so that for a I, second. So, uh, I want to warn people that, you know, the service isn't, it's not really the service, it's the kitchen. Mm -hmm. um, so, so you're food may not be coming out as fast as you're account, uh, used to it. At the Egg and I. So, if you're patient, it'll be good. It's always good. We know that. But uh, on that go. same note, are you looking for folks? Yes. Okay. We are hiring basically all positions. Okay. Wow, okay. Sounds like especially maybe kitchen for kitchen work. Especially kitchen. Yeah, yeah, mm -hmm. absolutely. Well, that's good to know. So this is it. Look at how perfect your pancake mm -hmm. is. You no, even I, did the flip. 
I tossed the blueberries mm -hmm. in that agave syrup. Okay. And we're gonna take the lemon curd. All right. Oops, that's what I brought this far. <laughs> All your cute utensils. If you haven't noticed, Steve has the best utensils. Okay, a little lemon curd. Oh, of course, you gotta it, make it pretty. Can give you three of them. Three dollops, them. kind of like a butter replacement. <laughs> All right. Except way tastier. I have a feeling. I'll let you know. So. And then the blueberries go on top. Blueberries? So pretty. Not quite okay. done. Oh, we're not done, of course. Powdered sugar. Powdered sugar. Oh, love that. Love it, love it, love Voila. it. <laughs> well, I'll let you know how it is. Now, a lot of your dishes at the Egg and I, what should I do? Spread a little? What's the technique? You know, whatever works for different people. I know, and I'm being, making, making it up as I go. But a lot of dishes at the Egg and I are gluten friendly, is that right? Mm -hmm. Oh, quite a lot of them. Yeah. And if they aren't, we can generally make them that way. I mean, that, there's mm -hmm. not much we can do with a pancake. I love this. Mm -hmm. Okay. We can the adjust things good. Uh, for people that want to have mm -hmm. something gluten free. Lots of great healthy options for spring. Mm -hmm. I'm just going to keep eating your pancake. <laughs> um, anything else you want to let people know real quick before we go? We've got uh, great Easter that's open. These guys are off the, the belt line mm -hmm. um, and a really big space. Even have a meeting room that's oh, it's free to use. And it's a wonderful spot to go mm -hmm. if you've got a, a bigger uh, party that you want to accommodate. So. Sure. That was one of the, the uh, factors, I think, that helped us with In Business Madison Magazine's Executive Choice Award, which we've won for the third time in a row. Congratulations. Well, so, for breakfast. Well-deserved. Fabulous breakfast. All the food's good. Steve Gascom, owner of The Egg and I, thanks for being here. Thank you. Go get yourself a blueberry lemon pancake. We'll be back with more Restaurant Show coming up right after this.